What's up YouTube? Welcome to .NET Mo. In this video, I will show you how to create or generate DB script from SQL Server Management Studio. Before starting this video tutorial, I would like to ask you a favor. If you found this video helpful, please like this video. And for more awesome videos like this, please be subscribed to this channel at .NET Mo. It is a great idea to generate DB script from Management Studio because it has some good features like if you want to share your DB structure or data with your friends or colleagues you can do that or if you want to take database backup you can do that or if you want to migrate your database from one instance of SQL Server into another because it may cause if you are going to attach MDF file into new SQL Server it may cause version compatibility problem you can avoid this version compatibility for going with DB script other than these features you have the full control over the generated db script before executing this generated script you can do whatever you want according to your requirement so if you are a db person it would be a great feature for you from management studio so without further background explanation let's get to the point first of all i will show you how to create db script for database objects like tables store procedures etc so here we have a database expand it then under tables you can see the tables inside this database if i want to generate db script or sql query for this table image right click on it then script table as then create to window so in order to generate db script for this table image we have this much options here new query editor window file clipboard and agent job Using this option, you can see the corresponding query for this table inside a new query editor window. With this file option, you can directly save that query into file directory. You can save that query into clipboard using this option. Finally, we have agent job. Using this option, you can schedule this DB generation. Right now, I'm going to use this option. Click on new query editor window right now you can see the sql query to create this table image now if i want to create this table in another database just copy the script from here now i'm going to create this image table in this database phone book db right click on it then new query paste sql query here then click on execute so if you expand this db phone book db just refresh this tables node then you can see the new table image there. now if you want to create db script for store procedures you can follow same steps for that right click on the store procedure then script store procedure as create to new query window file clipboard agent board click on this option here so here we have the sql query to create this store procedure here so right now we are created db script for creating the store procedure if you want to see the sql query for altering or dropping the store procedure you can right click then script as and we have this much options alter to drop to drop and create and execute to these options will be available for tablets only so far we have created db script for store procedure and tablets and you can do the same for functions as well right click on it then script function as create to new query editor window if you want to create the same function in another database you can do that using this sql query and now let's check how we can create db script for multiple objects for that go to view then object explorer details if you want to create db script for multiple tables click on tables in object explorer then hold control select multiple tables from this uh, object explorer details right click on it then script table as create to new query window so here we have the sql query to create the tables banks business type and chamber of commerce so far we have created db script for single objects in tables store procedures functions with this method you can create db script for multiple objects in tables store procedures or functions using the next method you can create db script as a bulk 
if you want to create db script for the ender database you can do that as well if you want to create db script for some tables and some store procedures and functions you can do that as well so let's look how we can create db script as a bulk for that right click on database then task generate scripts here we have two options script ender database and all objects so this option will create db script for all the objects in the database with the second option we have the choice of selecting database objects for db script generation so if i want to select some tables from here i can do that if you want to select some store procedure from here you can do that or if you want to select all of these store procedure you can select this option then we want this function so select that as well then click on this next button keep this output type as it is then we have advanced options here click on that so in this advanced script option here we have a lot of options to configure your db script generation for now i will discuss most important options with this option generated db script will have sql query to check whether the database object like table store procedure is existing or not so with this option generated db script will have two operation first of all it will drop the database objects and then it will create the database objects then we have script for server versions suppose if you want to generate db script for sql server 2012 you can do that as well so with this option you can manage the version compatibility with this option if you set it as true you can see this sql query use then database name so this statement will be there in the top of the generated db script then we have type of data to script for this option we have this much values data only schema only schema and data schema only means in the generated db script will have the sql query to create the ender selected database objects for tables it will be like create table then table name then column list with constraints primary key and foreign key with this data only option generated db script will have insert query for the selected tables so with this schema and data option it will include all the information about the database structure as well as data then we can check whether we want to include constraints foreign key indexes primary key triggers and unique key so with this advanced options you can configure your db script generation then click on ok so in this window we have three export options save to file save to clipboard and save to new query window inside save to file we have two options single file single file per object single file objects means a single file will be generated for all tables stored procedures functions etc with the second option single file per objects there will be separate file for each database objects that means for one table there will be one dot sql file with this option you can select the location where you want to save this generated db script then i will select desktop as the script location db script click on save then click on next click on next script generation is in progress so script is generated successfully click on finish let me check my desktop so here we have the generated db script right click on it click on open generated db script will look like this first of all we have the use statement for the database then it will delete all of the constraints then it will drop the functions then it will drop tables then functions will be dropped after that it will create all of these functions tables uh, store procedures then it will insert data into the table that's it if you found this helpful please be subscribe to this channel dot
In this tutorial, we have discussed how to create DB script from Management Studio. If you have any doubt or feedback, please comment below in comment box. Please like and share this video with your friends and colleagues. Have a nice day. Bye.